Good morning! <laughs> it's freaking cold. <laughs> It's freaking cold. That's what you want. It's freaking cold. You ready for bed? <laughs> no, but let's do it. <laughs> We're about to go. Let's go. Hey guys, uh, we're walking to the top gonna stretch out and get ready and then we're gonna get the sprint in we're gonna do a total of 12 three sets of fours every four sprints we're gonna take a two minute break and then go at it again so we're gonna have a good workout after this we're gonna go to the gym get explosive workout in and I don't think he's really ready for it <laughs> but he's been pushing himself I know he's gonna do it easy on the grind! <laughs> I'm gonna share with you a tip. Okay, let me share with you and then I'm gonna share with them. So I'm gonna tell them a tip. Um, so when you launch off, find a point to look at because you went around, like you were wavering. When you waver around, you give yourself less time to get to the end point. <laughs> Same thing when you're on the field, when you do the 60 yard dash for the competition and tryout, what you wanna do is you wanna find a focus point. Stay low, slowly guide yourself up Stand up slowly. You don't want to go straight up right away. And then you want to, right when you start to look to sprint, you should find a point. For me right now, if I, like when, when I go from over there, I go to right there. That's what I'm looking at the whole time. So that, that spot where there's no branches or anything, that's my focus point when I'm running. Make sense? set down two more to go a rating from one to ten i'm about a six where are you at robert rating from one to ten where are you at on the scale of tiredness like six six you feel sick okay we're gonna get going got one more let's go <laughs> done we got it done now we're gonna head to the gym get this explosive workout in and we're good to go all right you guys if you want to improve on your explosiveness here's four explosive workouts for baseball players let's get into it What up you guys, if you know me personally, you know that I am horrible with names. However, I'm really good with faces. And so Robert and I have both been trying to improve on our ability to remember people's names. On Tuesday, when we went to the gym, we met the lady at the front desk and we said that we would remember her name today when we saw her. And if we didn't, we would get her Starbucks. Today we went to the gym and we saw her and she said, what's my name? And I said, Caitlin. And I was so confident and felt so good. I was like, yeah, I remember your name. Too bad I was wrong. <laughs> Her name is Catalina. Oh. 